Hello and welcome to Brainy Gardener. Today it is all about how to grow and care for the Ionium blushing beauty plants. The Ionium blushing beauty plants, also known as blushing Ioniums, are beautiful succulent plants that are easily recognizable by their large striking rosettes of thick, glossy leaves with a bright green center and red margins. Given its wide range of growing conditions and its ornamental value, it's easy to see why Yonium, Blushing Beauty, has earned an award of Garden Merit from the Royal Horticultural Society, RHS. Like most other Yonium varieties, Yonium, Blushing Beauty, is a succulent plant that requires little care once established. It is easy to maintain and can be grown in various conditions. This perennial does not require much water, but needs some supplemental moisture during extreme heat or drought periods. However, this relatively hands-off plant does have a few specific needs. Ionium, blushing beauty, does best in full sun or partial shade. It can tolerate shade, but will be less colorful if grown in this condition. If you are growing ionium in partial shade, ensure it is not under the canopy of other taller plants or trees. The plant will also benefit from being placed near an east-facing window to enjoy the morning sun. Ioniums have a relatively small root system, and unlike other succulents, they need to be watered regularly. While drought-tolerant, ioniums are not drought-proof. Water the plant when the soil is dry to touch, but don't let it sit in water. Watering should be done in the morning or late afternoon when the sun isn't as hot. Ionium, blushing beauty, grows best in sandy, dry to medium moisture, well-drained soils that contain some grit or gravel for drainage. This succulent plant has very little tolerance for standing water. When growing it in pots, ensure that the soil drains well. Ionium, blushing beauty, prefers temperatures between 65 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit. It will grow in warmer temperatures, but may not flower as much under these conditions. Humidity should be kept between 40% and 60% for optimal growth. On the other hand, too much moisture can cause stem rot, so be sure not to overwater it or keep it in areas that get overly humid. Ionium, blushing beauty, prefers a Mediterranean climate with slightly cool and damp winters and hot summers. Ionium, blushing beauty, needs fertilizer once every two to three weeks during the growing season. However, ioniums may go dormant in summer and don't need any fertilizer during that time. If your plant is growing well, you can apply a balanced fertilizer at half strength such as 20-20-20 or 10-10-10. Fertilizers with different ratios are often labeled for indoor and outdoor use. There are several ways to propagate your ionium, but the most common way is by taking cuttings. This simple process involves cutting off a piece of your plant and sticking it into some soil to grow. To propagate ionium, blushing beauty by stem cuttings, Use a sharp, clean cutting tool and clip off a piece of the leaf rosette from a younger stem. Place the cutting in a dry, warm location for a few days to allow it time to heal before transplanting. Place the cutting in a pot or container with high quality, well draining soil. Water your new plant weekly and place it in a sunny location where it can receive plenty of light but not direct sun exposure. Keep the soil moist but not soggy until new growth appears. Once you see the new growth, water the plant less frequently. You should repot your ionium when its roots are filling the pot or have begun to grow out of it. You may also need to repot if you notice that the plant has stopped blooming or isn't growing as quickly as it once did. So even if your plant looks healthy, it may still need repotting. Repot your ionium blushing beauty every two years during its fall or spring growth period. Use a container that is only one size larger than the current pot. This allows the roots some room to grow into their new home without becoming root bound. Make sure that drainage holes are not blocked by any rocks or soil in the bottom of your pot. If they are blocked, use perlite or sand as an alternative medium for drainage. 
Any good commercial potting soil will work well as long as it drains well. Avoid using soil from your yard because it may contain pests that are hard to get rid of. The Ionium blushing beauty plant is not toxic to humans or animals. It is always advisable to wash one's hands before and after handling this plant and put on gardening gloves. Ionium blushing beauty is susceptible to common pests like mealybugs, scales, and mites. You can remove these pests by wiping them off with a cotton swab dipped in neem oil or by spraying the plant with a mixture of water and dish soap.